Hey folks, I'm back. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Peace and blessings be upon you all. Welcome back to day seven of my fasting progress. Guys, I've got something to share with you, an experience, something that happened to me today. I went for a workout and that workout consisted of a deadlift and now I was handling quite a substantial amount of weight and what happened, I was rushing my exercise. So therefore I rushed my exercise and I suffered the consequences of a back injury. That's right, I've injured my back now. I'm finding it quite difficult to sit and walk, but I'm working with this. But let me tell you something, the lesson I wanna share and what I've got from this experience is this, is to adopt humility. Yes, that's right. Whenever we're at our pinnacle of success, and success is defined by each and every person, success is your own personal thing, not someone telling you that you're successful or not. That's defined by your own achievement. Now, now that I've said that, I have adopted humility because that is the thing that I've learned from this. Before I even go on further to my success, I need to be humbled for every step or second, third step. At some point, each and every person will get humbled. And it's down to you to take on the lesson, to reflect and to be grateful and humble yourself, then you can truly move on and progress because each stoppage is there for your own good. Each stoppage is there so you don't cause further harm. And success works like this. You're going up, you're going up, you're going up. And at some point, you will be brought back down. And when you do get brought back down, when you're humbled, you need to take the lesson. You need to be grateful. You need to regroup yourself. You need to reflect and then you need to refine and move forward. This is the lesson I got from this experience, people. It's all about trying to adopt humility and gratitude in your character. Because let me tell you something, whether you realize it or not, the more successful you are, the more arrogant you become, unless you're aware of it, or unless you're aware of it, sorry. Because let me tell you something, arrogance seeps in whether you know it or not, at some stage in your life, at some stage in the point of your success, and you will get humbled at some point. You will, whether it be in public or behind closed doors, and it's down to you to get the message, to take it on board, and to do something about it. That is the lesson I thought I might bring to your attention. That is a lesson I thought I might share with you guys out there. Let's adopt humility and gratitude. So people, until then, take care, stay strong, stay focused, and always live to learn to empower and inspire the lives of many, as well as yourself. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.